hello today i'm going to show you how you can display record without refresh the page so first of all i am going to take here one div tag now first of all we have to create one table so i will show you perfectly how you can do this database name is auto refresh now i am going to create one table name and city now going to save this and now here i am going to insert one record go okay so now we uh, we have one table now here we have one div and here we have to create one javascript here i am going to type one function and here we are going to use edges so we need few lines for edges and here we have to create one php page php name should be select.php and here we have to show the response we are going to uh, show response in get inside get data div now we have to create one page select.php and here we have to perform database connectivity our database name is auto refresh let me check yes auto refresh now here we have to database connectivity here we have to display record and here we have to display our record and here we have to pass br okay so now here we are going to call this function only dis and now we are going to check we get simple record or not we are not getting in record so we have to check why this happen
yes problem is here here we have to pass array this mistake uh, did this dream viewer because this dream dream viewer is not supported for mysqli so we did not get any types of l now we are going to check here we get here this record amit raj got now here i am going to take one function and here we have to give interval i am going to give here 2000 it means 2 second 2000 means millisecond so it is a 2 second and here i am going to pass this di function so this di function work when page load first time and this will work in after uh, every 2 second now we are going to check using another browser so here we are going to open php my admin now i am going to insert one record here test and test and now i am going to press this go button and we will check here you can see i get record here without refresh the page again we are going to test so this way we can do this without refreshing the page thank you